Tiger Lily Squad, what's poppin'? 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 What's hey? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? Hey, what's poppin'? What's poppin'? Hey, Tiger Lily Squad, gang gang. How you living? How you breathing? How you feeling? It's your girl. Look at my seat. Look at my seat. It's your girl, Essence of Shea. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I wanted to do a quick video and just talk to you guys about the things that you do not need when you're starting your life journey. You do not need these things unless you might have longer hair or something's going on, but you do not need this stuff. So the first thing on the list is you don't need scrunchies because your hair is probably this length or shorter and just pulling it back in that tension and all that stuff is just not good for the locks. So most likely you do not need a scrunchie. Tension on your locks is not good. Scrunchies normally like pull the strands out so it's really not necessary. The second thing that you don't need is a bunch of products. So I feel like in the beginning stages all you literally need is some kind of moisture. So either you can get my um, lavender hair mist or my chamomile ginger hair mist and it has oil and stuff in there not a lot but it helps with like a seal sealant properties when you spray the mist so that will be it or you can go and get some vitamin um, not vitamin water rose water and some vitamin e and literally that's all you need um products is not a necessity in the lot game, mature or starting, I just, it's just not necessary. Conditioners, all that stuff, cut it out. All these things is just gonna help you save money. Hello. The third thing I would say is you don't need a shower cap unless you just got your hair retwisted and you just styled it. Then that's the only reason why I can see that you'll go in a shower with a shower cap because the steam just helps moisturize your hair, makes your locks look a little juicier, helps fast forward the locking process. Because if you haven't watched that video before, I talked to, talk to you about how water is a good thing, not only moisturizing your hair, but helps your hair to lock as well. So go watch those videos. I'm giving y'all knowledge. I'm giving y'all knowledge. And then what else don't you need? Oh, you don't need um, rubber bands because the rubber band method as far as like retwisting your hair, I feel like in the beginning you definitely need clips. So you don't, you don't need any rubber bands at all. Literally none. You don't need to go necessarily to a loctician. You can, if you're in the market of like, like just saving your money a little bit more, I would say you don't need a loctician, especially in this time. I feel like we're probably gonna go back into quarantine. So you're probably gonna have to learn how to redo your hair. Sorry about the light chain, the sun. That bit, nope. Is that better yeah so um you don't need a loctician in the beginning at all um a little contradictory to what i'm doing i just decided to go the lazy way out and i just didn't want to do my hair but i say i really don't feel like uh you think you need one and the fifth thing is you don't need protective styles a lot of times people do like the crochet braids over their locks or they'll get the full locks on top of their locks 
which is all fine and good with the um the extensions i think they're called they're different from the full locks but they're like the extensions to just help with the lengthening process if you don't want to go through the ugly phase but protective styles from the research that i've seen that people have done over their starter locks it kind of caused some damage so i wouldn't suggest um doing that so that is something else that can help you save money so these are the things that i think that you don't need um for starter locks there's a whole bunch of other things that you don't need but these are like my top stuff that people ask me about they always ask me do shay do you need a shower cap they always say do you need like some kind of scrunchie or rubber bands or anything like that i'm like no they're always like do you need like conditioners or like creams or all these weird products i'm like no 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 that this is a good thing about having locks all that stuff they used to spend money on you literally don't have to spend money on them anymore you feel what i'm saying so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe put in a comment box below anything that you think that i missed out on on things that you don't need um with your starter locks listen i'm relearning all this thing i keep telling you guys this in every video i literally do not remember how my first set of locks went so like how it started so this is this is all new for me so as i learn i share with y'all all right y'all see you later sorry good little ladies Toodles. Uh, crash course let me have the money in the dashboard max mad could you lost the brick inside the porch goofy with